Campaigns ahead of the November 20th general elections in Ikuchura, Guinea has been unfolding in a quite friendly atmosphere since November 3rd, 2022, all over the country. Theodora Obengema Basago, flag bearer of the Democratic Party of Ikuchura, Guinea, the PDGE, accompanied by First Lady Constantia Mangedo Obiang, met 5,000 of supporters at the ABBM Stadium on day one of the campaigns. <laughs> Mr. Obiang was chosen by his party to run for a new mandate in the November 20th presidential election. The youths, women, children and the elderly, all dressed in different party fabrics, branded t-shirts and hats, waved flags and sang in celebration of the arrival of their candidates. Although Obiang Basago has always maintained a close relationship with the population, this outing seemed particular as it was a time for the people to tell their leader how happy they were with all that he has done for the nation while rallying their support for him to do more. Speaking to the crowd, who seemed unbothered despite the blazing sun, Mr. Obiangema began by applauding the population for their maturity in according their support towards the realization of the party's vision. Because we have seen that with peace, we have transformed the Guinea Equatorial. It means that it is the fruit of our work. It is the fruit of our will. It is the fruit of our harmony. Por lo tanto, así debemos continuar. El mensaje habla de la continuidad. Por lo tanto, no solo la continuidad de las realizaciones, sino la continuidad de nuestra convivencia. One message is loud and clear. Continuity. Continuity being the slogan of the Democratic Party of Equatorial Guinea, Mr. Obiang told his supporters that he seeks to continue with the program of economic diversification to Horizon 2035, continuity of peace, stabilization, progress and development of the nation in which the party presents itself to advance the political program for the coming years to strengthen these objectives. Not forgetting that the man considered the epitome of modern Ekitura Guinea took out time to highlight all that has been achieved during the mandate that has just ended. From the construction of highways and airports with a focus on economic expansion, diversification and the exportation of capital from Ekitura Guinea to Africa and the world at large. More emphasis is now being made towards self-sufficiency and the consumption of locally made products, a message which Mr. Obiang shares with his African counterparts to limit dependency on Western products. Por eso, la lucha que tenemos ahora es para completar la felicidad en nuestra población. Pero esta lucha no la puede emprender únicamente el gobierno. Quiero asociarles a ustedes que todos somos beneficiarios. Las dolencias que la población acusa es consecuencia de nuestro mal comportamiento. Uben Guillermo Basago appeared for the first time as a political figure in Equatorial Guinea when the country was on the verge of succumbing to a dictatorial and totalitarian regime that annulled any nation of national sovereignty. Equatoria Guinea can still remember the sad moments with the poor appearance of their cities, the lack of electricity throughout the country, the lack of roads and more. However, the story has changed over time. Now, 
The country has well constructed cities and express roads linking all the regions and villages. Two years of COVID-19 crisis that has been overcome, the crisis in Ukraine and the fall in the price of oil. Despite all these, and since oil is a perishable product, the political program that has been designed by the Democratic Party of Ekaterina Guinea for the next seven years appears to have foreseen a medium and long-term strategy that includes a diversification of the sources of uh, national uh, production considering the great resources of the sectors of tourism, agriculture, fishing, the industrialization and rational exploitation of the economic base infrastructures that the government has built. The Democratic Party of Equatorial Guinea, being the pioneering party in the democratic game, presents itself not only with that great experience, but also presents an agenda of continuity with the programs that have been successful up to now and that have provided Ekito Guineans with a sustainable, realistic and viable development and has also achieved peace and stability. The Democratic Party of Ekitura Guinea believes that it is thanks to its approaches that Ekitura Guinea has become a reference in Africa and within the international community. Mr. Obiang remarks that there is no doubt about this political stability which is envied by many who want to lecture Ekito Guineans on human rights. He says there will be no peace in Ekitura Guinea without respect of individual freedoms, the inclusion of women and youth, improvement in all economic, health and education fields, tolerance to multiculturalism, religious and ethnic, the concern for the most vulnerable players of the society, a fact that without doubt has consolidated the country's social cohesion. Que son militares, eh, que son jueces, porque son los que están cometiendo estragos a la población. Considered the most experienced politician in the Central African region, Obian Gema Basogo cautioned his compatriots not to entrust to adventures while reminding them of the old saying, I quote, an old friend known is better than a new unknown one. End of quote. Therefore, as a PDGE candidate, Mr. Obiangema Basago assured that their mission is to improve the quality and living conditions of the population and make effective their party's idea of doing good and avoiding evil. He also appealed to the population not to be carried away by the treacherous voices of certain illegal oppositions. While we keep a close watch on the electoral process, the atmosphere remains calm and peaceful as the campaigns for presidential, senatorial, legislative and council elections unfold in the different regions and cities of Ekitura, Guinea. And of course, the atmosphere here, you can see here, looking like one of a very important party or celebration. Of course, it's not celebration. We are here at the BBM Stadium, uh, where campaigns ahead of the November 20th presidential uh, parliamentary and municipal elections was launched here. President uh, Obiang Gemma Basogo, accompanied by the First Lady and other members of the PDGE uh, political party, were here at the BBM Stadium. Hello.